Jay, just uh, with Fan Appreciation Day, what does it mean to have so many fans out here, and, and what does that do for the practice sessions, and then also just your appreciation afterward? I think it'll be fun for the fans to get a look at uh, you know the team for the first time, uh, and it'll be fun for the players to get out here. I just hope they're not too amped up and start, you know, all the crazy trash talking, and then somebody gets on a push and shove and match. That's what I'm trying to guard against. But it'll be fun. It'll be high energy, I'm sure. We have a couple live sessions today. It'll be kind of fun. Some goal line short yardage, which will be fun. I'm sure the players will enjoy that. You know, best three out of five short yardage, best three out of five goal line. So we'll get them juiced up. Then we'll have some live sessions there at the end too. Uh, so. It'll be a good practice. Um, get some tackling in here and, and see what happens. But uh, it's awesome the fans come out here. We're very appreciative uh, of our stay here in Richmond. They've been great to us. Uh, Mont Secure has been excellent to us. Uh, the Omni has been great. So uh, it's a first-class organization here, and, and uh, we're happy to be part of it. For a small business like Old Ox Brewery, having a financial partner like Main Street is crucial to help us continue to grow. They provided us with a line of credit to help us with working capital. They helped us with equipment financing. In manufacturing, you're the first one to put money out and the last one to get paid. And without a great financial partner like Main Street Bank, we would not be able to see the success and growth that we are achieving right now. My name is Graham Burns, and I'm one of the owners and founders of Old Ox Brewery, home company in Ashburn, soon to be opening here in Middleburg, Virginia. Old Ox Brewery has been open for about five years now. We opened in 2014. Uh, we are a production brewery, which means that we not only brew beer, but we can it, we bottle it. Uh, we uh, put it out in kegs so that it's served in local taverns and restaurants. It's sold in grocery stores, liquor stores, pretty much anywhere you can buy beer, you're going to find Old Ox beer these days. We distribute in Northern Virginia primarily, but also in the District of Columbia. What makes good beer? That's a tough question. I, to me, it's the people that make it. Uh, we have a dedicated brewing staff. Uh, starting with a head brewer that's uh, got her doctorate in molecular chemistry, uh, all down to the brew crew, down to the guys that come in on canning days to help us package the beer, uh, and then the marketing and social media that goes behind it. The community means everything to us. We would not be here if it wasn't for the support of our community in so many ways. Uh, so we feel that it's incumbent upon us to try to give back whenever we can. Monday through Friday, 9 to 5, we have forklifts running all over the factory floor, but after hours, we can use that for gathering, meet with their friends, they can make new friends, they can enjoy conversation over a beer. And it's that same thing that we hope to bring to Middleburg. First of all, Middleburg is a totally unique community. It's small, uh, it's, it's got a small town feel to it. We found out through construction that everybody knows what's going on here about five minutes after it happens. So we, you know, we can't tell them anything new. But it's, it's a great space. It's right in the middle of town. Uh, we've spent a lot of time and effort uh, creating an outdoor beer garden space that I think people are really going to enjoy. Well, our banking re uh, relationship was already established, and our primary lending officer was this guy named Jimmy Olivson. Uh, and Jimmy moved over to Main Street Bank, and it was a no-brainer for us to follow him. Uh, Main Street has been there every step of the way with us. And, and we look forward to keeping that relationship going into the future.